Hey, what up everybody? I hope you're all doing well. <clears throat> so, just making sure the last few things are in place and then we will get the game started. Okay, everything seems to be in place. We are good to go. So, before we actually kick off with everything, just to let everybody know, tonight we're going to be starting with some Power World. Now, you might see that it says new start because I did technically start this in the past. I never really got anywhere with it. I haven't really experienced much of this game. It came out, I bought it, I started playing it, and then I got distracted with a whole bunch of other things and never, never really got anywhere meaningful with the game. So, I thought, hey, what? Let's actually return to the game. Let's actually try it off again. Let's actually try a new start and see how far we can go at that point. Now, I'm not sure what to expect. I don't know how well this is going to do. Hopefully, it does relatively well. Um, just a short little recap. We are trying to reach that 50 follower goal. So, please try to help spread the word as much as you possibly can. Reach out to friends, reach out to family, share it on social media, um, any kind of Discord groups or other live streamers that you are part of. Try and spread the word as much as you can. It really would mean a lot. And for those of you that don't know, all of my past live streams do get posted onto my YouTube channel. So if you end up missing a stream and you want to catch up, by all means, go show some love on my YouTube channel as well. Go subscribe, turn on those notifications to see when past live streams do get posted. Also, we have a Discord. The Discord is a place where we as a community can gather outside of the streams, a place where you can chill, chat, relax, talk with the community, and basically just grow. <laughs> and also there are some um, events that will take, be taking place there in the future, so some love over there would also be highly appreciated. But without further ado, let's actually get into this game and get it started. So we're going to stick with the same name, uh, Presets. Uh, let's just grab this dude, body. Torso size, that's eh, fine. Arm size, let's go a little bit bigger arms, let's go a little bit skinnier legs, sorted. Face. Why, why do all the guys look so grumpy? Oh my God. Everybody looks so goddamn grumpy. Um. Drop a chat face. <laughs> yeah, we'll just go with this. Uh, we'll go with the glowing eyes. Eye color, we'll make it white. Uh, eyebrow color, we'll make it white as well. I want white, like pure fucking white. There we go. There we go. Gonna look kind of stupid right now, but it all makes sense once the hair matches. Some avatar ethereal looking motherfucker. I don't exactly have a lot of options. Yeah, fuck it, we'll go with this here. And that was a close-up zoom. Voice. Uh, yeah, sounds about right. Oh, I think the game volume might be a little bit too low. Screw it, that's our character. Towers are the key. The tree holds the truth. Okay, and here we start over now. First thing I need to do is obviously just get this sound up. Uh, master volume can go up a bit. I don't know if there is any decent background music or not, so we'll just stick with that. I need to see how. 
really? No ways I have to restart just to be able to change some sound. Okay, just boost the game over here. Okay, this is where I'm going to need some feedback. If you guys can hear anything, let me know. If you can't hear anything, let me know. Hold on, there has to be some kind of background music because this is quiet as fuck. Uh, sound, background music. Nice, the pearls, ambient. I mean, it can go up a bit, the voice can go up a bit, UI can go up, um, special effects can go up, master can go up, music over there. Okay, I'm hoping the sound isn't too loud. Let's have a look. So, enhance our points. First things first, let's try to get some stamina, technology, uh, spheres. Wooden chest, power box, repair bins, wooden structures, campfire can't be yet. Okay, so now the important part is figuring out where we are going to build. So we can start over here and then obviously expand later on. But I think I want to make my life a little bit easier in the beginning. And I'm probably going to go build a little bit further down there. I don't feel like I'm getting a lot of stuff from this. We might want to change the settings. Because I don't want to obviously grind forever in a day trying to get some of the most basic things. I want this to be a relatively fun experience. Focusing more on the pulls than the grinding for materials. That's the goal at least. But we'll see once we've got tools to see if it actually is better. Increase our weight, technology, campfire, bows, arrows, a bed, straw bed, and cloth will be next on the list. So I am playing on relatively, like, very easy mode. I did try and duck change the settings um, for XP rates, uh, material drop rates, material health rates, how much we get, etc, etc. Like I said, I don't want to focus on boring stuff for too much uh, okay do I need a chicken I don't need a chicken I think let's try and get hold of one of these there's a big ass bird there definitely not getting that guy yeah Four. One. Two. Yeah, we should get that. Nice. We've got our first little pal. And once our stats, we're gonna go with uh, some more stamina. And then technology. I oh, know we need cloth. Common shield, I'm not worried about. Stone spear, cloth outfit. A feed box is definitely something we are going to need. That's metal up there. I kind of got an idea where I want to place that on the first. That's a big boy. Did I actually end up getting that fast travel point up there? I don't think I did. I think I fucked that. Acquired one technology. Um, feeding box. And then technology. Good on that. Pull deck. Okay, so we know nothing about them. We've just basically seen them. I'm going to want one of the little 
I'm, I'm basically calling them Psyducks. They look like a discolored version of a Psyduck. Okay, and this is the area that we are going to build our first base here. Yeah. There's some leather. That's going to be massive. Hi, right, and I think this is where we start. We build a house right here against these trees. I've got no idea what that is. Oh, it's a chest. Uh, copper key needed. Don't have the copper key. Okay, so let's start this off. Um, put in foundation. Let's go one. Oh no, I forgot how we do this. It is built continuously. Yes, one there. On there, on there, on there, on there. And I think that's a good enough point for us just to start for now. Yeah. Uh, let's go with some walls. Nope. Uh, let's go with some windows first. Window there. I keep forgetting. Continuous, continuous, continuous. Let's put a single wall in the back. And then one. That one. That one. That one. And then we just throw a little shitty roof on top of this. We want to build it double. Let's build it double. I think we're just going to mimic what we've got at the moment. Uh, door. We can go there. Materials insufficient. All right. I do not need to do that. Come back here. Okay, we're getting there. Um, bed, we need wood and we need wool. Campfire, we need wood. Storage, we need wood. Pile box, we need wood. Repair bench, we need wood. Okay, so I accidentally used up all my wood. Okay, enhanced stats, we're gonna go for some more weight. Technology, we want the um, berry plantation, furniture. So what's the difference between a fire bow and a normal bow? Burn spells with fire arrows making them easier. That would be the arrows that's important, right? That seems counterintuitive, but we'll ignore that for now. Okay, let's go ahead and build the primitive workbench. Can I put the workbench inside the house? Probably. Yes, I can. Okay, so let's go into the corner, right against the back. Yeah, seems as good a place as any. Okay, we need a repair bench. Ooh, that's skew. I don't know why, but my OCD kicks in when it comes to this kind of shit. That's straight er. Hey, what up, Maestro? How are you doing this evening, brother? Hope you're doing good. I've got this idiot for a reason. Come back. Uh, was just watching the Necropolis League announcement. Necropolis League announcement. What's that all about? No, come here. Uh, that's item management. Okay, I need stone. 
Can I punch a rock with my bare hands? I don't know if I actually get shit that way. The next league for PoE. I'm actually really excited for it as well. I think probably with the start of the next league, I'm going to go back into PoE a lot more. See how it changes, see what the game introduces. But that obviously means I'm going to need a league starter. It offers a new crafting system. So you're basically trying to say more stuff to make us confused with. Sounds about right. With one with more power to affect the outcome of your crafting, kind of like harvest. Okay. Okay, now that we've actually got some tools, now we can actually start getting the right shit that we need. Yeah, and the collection of materials is a lot faster this way. Free wood. Nice. See if we can't get this finished off first. I know I need to build a pal box, and the pal box normally has to go outside. But the radius around it is always so shit. Like it's so big. How close can I get it to there? So it somewhat looks like it's neat. Yeah, that works. Yeah, let's bring out this dude. That's done. Now, inside here, yeah, uh, base upgrades. Okay. Let's finish off my house. Uh, right stairs. Right there. And then, let's go with some windows. There, there, there. There, and there. A wall. Right there, and then let's put the roof up. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we've got a, a shack. We have got the absolute bare minimum of what we need. Uh, furniture. I don't think I've got what I need for the bed yet. No, I need wool for that. Uh, food, we can put on a campfire so long. And we can at least start putting down some chests. There. Okay, I only got enough for, no, for one. Actually, wow. you can build. Decent amount of wood. Let's quickly grab some stone. Well, the reality of it is the league starters are probably going to be the same ones that are always good. There isn't really much of a choice that you get in changing a league starter, is there? You've only got like you've only truly got like a decision of like two or three. Yeah, the cheap ones. You need something that can be relatively powerful relatively quickly. Yeah. Whoa.
So probably something like raining arrows before you actually shoot over to tornado shot might be a good option. Um, you've obviously got the witch with the sparks and electricity with the totems, with the fire totems. So while there are options, the options still end up being limited. Can I put a campfire inside the house? Is putting a campfire inside the house something I really want to do? Yeah, fuck it, that way the creatures can't set themselves alight. Okay, let him finish that. Feed box I'll put outside, that's for them. Put it here right by the front door. Uh, power box is done, those are done, feed box is done, bed I can't do because I need wool so I need to go kill some creatures. We'll make it all pretty and decoration wise later on. For now let's just see what else I can build. Um, let's build a stone spear. Yeah, so the league start is basically just to get you through to the end as soon as possible so that you can start farming for the stuff that um, is making you money. Well, damn, brother, thank you. The guy's getting me some wood and I didn't even ask. See, and that's my, like, that's the one thing about PoE, that for me, for someone who plays the way I do, there's, there's no interest in that for me. I'm not trying to speed through to the end so that I can try and get hold of OP items quickly, so that I can try and get the currency to uh, be ahead of everybody else, I'm guessing, to try and take benefit of a new market. That's not something that I'm interested in. I just want to enjoy a build, have fun with it. However, unfortunately, that does mean that I need currency. And if I join the party too late, it ends up being behind on currency and having to rely on people like yourselves who basically end up building shit for me. And that's also something I don't want to continuously do. So at some point, I'm going to have to either make that switch to say, okay, I'm going to start focusing a lot more on PoE and my streams have to focus more, a lot more on PoE to be able to grind out the constant chasing. Or I'm just going to have to realize that, hey, I'm never going to be one of those people that is the go-to person for PoE. definitely but also it'll it'll make it it'll also make it more frustrating for you like i've got no problems playing with people whatsoever I'm more than happy to do that i just i know it'll be more frustrating for you because you're going to be on a much faster pace than someone like myself please tell me you can work there yes you can it could us Or maybe you can have two characters running. I know that's that's like sounds counterproductive, but maybe you could have two characters running. One character that you run on your own at your own pace at your own speed, and then one character that you only use when we play together. That could be an option.
Yeah, because I know that your pace when it comes to this kind of stuff is going to be a lot faster. Like, a lot, a lot faster. Okay, I'll let him finish that. I've got quite a few arrows. I need to kill a few things because I need cloth. So... Uh, where's these blue little things? Oh god, I fucked up. Uh, I'm thinking of Wintertide or Stormbrand. Ooh. I know Stormbrand, I don't know Wintertide. What's Wintertide? Hey, Wandering Trader. Wintertide brand. Don't know that. That's not something that's usually coming to mind as something that I've done before. I don't think I've ever uh, played Wintertide. You are basically a fluffy Eevee. I apologize, but that gives me wool. And wool is something I really need right now. And that gave me egg and some meat. Okay. You'd have to link me the bolt so that I can see what the bolt looks like. But if you're going to go Wintertide or Stormbrand, I might go something like Grain of Arrows or potentially Totem. Fire Totem. Or maybe just good old fashioned sparks. Sparks with orbital storms. Might be a nice little option. Mm, can finally make a bed. So my house is cold, so about the torches. Let's put one right there. I don't know if torches actually just light up or if they actually help with the cold. I'm still cold. So I'm not freezing cold, but I'm cold, cold. I would think that inside the building you're automatically warm, but it doesn't seem like that's the case. Okay, so I've got a bed. Uh, baked berries. Really? I've got to cook it? I thought I just... Oh. Actually, yeah. you can go out. You can do stuff. Um, I'm at the point yet where I can build myself some clothes. I think I've got enough. Or do I need to make cloth first? 
I think there's a good chance I need to make cloth before I can actually make the clothes that I need. Okay, I think that's enough. We we'll cancel the rest of it. I need cloth, yep. So let's make two cloth. Let's make five cloth. Four cloth. It's apparently all I can afford. That's going to use up the last bit of my wool. But at least now I should have clothes. Alright, we can make that. Okay, we've actually got some clothes. Now I don't look like an absolute scrub. Take the sack, and let's wake up in the morning. Okay, uh, food. Let's... How the hell do I eat? Oh. I need to start putting some shit away. My inventory is full as fuck. Um, I'm not going to worry too much about where everything is. I'm just going to put it all away into the same storage units. Okay, so what I need to do, deploy a pal worker to the... This thing you in there. Got one at the base. Okay. Um, base upgrade. We can already base upgrade on that. Build the feed box and build the straw bed. I need wood. Just let me know if the game's sound is a bit too loud. Okay, with that done, let's build some of these beds. I want to make sure they're about as straight as I can get them. Okay, so they're straight there. 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 And one there. God damn, this stuff takes long to build. done i know i need to build something else as well workbench because the workbench is going to allow me if i'm not mistaken to be able to actually craft my uh pulse spheres yeah that's straight enough please do not run into the goddamn table into the fire please thank you okay cool <laughs> hey what up JJ how you doing man and yes it is the Pokemon Fortnite um, um, Arc Survival um, insert every open world survival game ever game yes how you doing this evening brother hope you're doing well A 
It's Poke Og. <laughs> Sorry, Pokey Og. <laughs> uh, technology. Let's have a look. I need the stone put. I need the logging site. But I need the insert Pokemon to be able to do those jobs. So I need to start thinking about capturing some shit. I definitely want one of those. I want one of those. That's a 10% chance. I ain't getting that shit, so... Ah, oh, got no more arrows left. Nice. Come on. Be nice. Two. Three. Alright, that's my personal battle. Now for... Dodgy internet. That's not good. Your shit just slow, or is there like a storm or something? Oh, come back here. Thank you. One of you. Okay, so this can gather and it can... Okay, so this does plants. So you can go inside there, you can stick around for now. Oh my god, dude. I need one of you, because you are going to do all my watering, basically. Thank you. It's always bad, to be fair. <laughs> Time for an upgrade, brother. Time for an upgrade. Okay, and this dude is going to be phenomenal because he can water my plants. So now, I can put down... Uh, where are they? Berry plantation. Where am I going to put the berry plantation? Yeah, we'll put the berry plantation behind this thing. So line it up, kind of. Right there. And then I don't have the rest of the materials for it, so... Just worse in the evenings. What size line do you actually have? Is it worse in the evenings because like people in the house are just using up like all the rest of the internet, or it's just shit in the evening because the network provider is shit? Oh shit! Okay, so they can actually be planting over there. That little monster's doing good. How do I get more berry seeds? Oh, I've got more, some more berries right up the road, yeah. There we go. Berry seeds. Okay, I need to see if I can't get myself a... I'm probably going to fuck up the names of all the pals because I'm probably going to see them and I'm going to compare them to their Pokemon versions. So I don't know what it's called in this game, but I probably... That's a C-Dot. Like, that is 100% a C-Dot. And then I'm looking for a Flareon. Which is basically... Yeah, we all know what a Flareon is. Fire version of Eevee. I'll take you. The Flareons tend to chill around your summer areas. A uh, Fox Pox. It's not my house, it's the UK being bad. Capping speeds and my location next to a shopping park. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, okay, I'm with you. Yeah, that sucks balls, bro. It's a 7% rate on that. I don't have any arrows, so I've got to chase him by foot. Come back here. I need this for all my cooking and smelting purposes. So please don't kill me. Five, eighty-eight, eighty-nine, and a hundred percent. Thank you. Oh yeah, I got my Flareon. Or oh, Fox Pox. And then the Kremis, which is basically just an Eevee. I don't actually know what you do. Uh, let's go with... I want that or do I want 
Oh my god, the attack does nothing. Stamina is maybe a better option there. Technology, I want the necklace for this. What does this do? It will stay by your side and attacks enemies in tandem. Ooh, I'll take that. Wooden tavern cabinet furniture set. Poison arrows will go with the crusher. And we'll keep the rest of the points for stuff that I actually need. Now, if you phone your network provider and you ask them if they're capping your internet, do they actually physically tell you they're capping it? Or are you paying for like an uncapped line, but they cap it with like thinking that you don't know about it? Either way, that's fucked. Um, okay, what did I want to do? Why was I here? Yeah, I need arrows. Start production. Yeah, little thing. You can come and do that. Inside here. Let's upgrade this quickly. And let's put this guy in. So now I've got somebody who's going to be seeding, somebody who's going to be watering. I've got a general task and a miner. It's the government that caps the speed, not the providers. That's fucked. Since when do governments have say on what network providers give? That seems a little stupid. Okay, so you guys are doing your thing. That guy's busy making my arrows. I've got beds for all of Oh, I'm one bed too short. Insufficient, I need wood. Why do I always need wood? Anyway, how's the game so far? Game's not bad at all. It's, it's very forgiving in how it introduces you. Like I said, I did start the game. Um... Uh, it's not the first I'm playing it, but I didn't get anywhere the first time I played through it, so I'm actually going to try and invest into trying to make it somewhat further. I think in the past I've maybe got like two, maybe three hours into it, so really nothing fancy. I think like this is what I'm doing now is as far as I got the first time I played through. So I've got a base understanding of it, but I've never fought any of the bosses. I've never like captured any like ridiculously powerful uh, pals or anything like that. So, yeah. It's going to be a fair introduction as to how good this game actually is. And everybody else rants about how good it is. When do you get to make a mansion? I guess the moment you unlock the technology for it. Well, technically I've got wood, so I could make a wooden mansion if I wanted to. Um, do I have the skills to do that? That's a completely different topic. So under the technology, there is 50 trees. And I'm guessing throughout here, oh, this is we start getting to the guns and shit. Ice grenades, single shot rifles. Yeah. But I, mean, I guess eventually it allows you to upgrade in structures, to like stone structures, etc, etc. I'm guessing at that point you can try and make it fancier. But then again, do I have the skills to be able to do that? Probably not. It's the same as Ark Survival Evolved. Like, I had access to everything to be able to build what I wanted to. But I always ended up building something relatively simple-ish. I had some that were really, really nice. But, um, yeah. I just never had the skill to be able to do anything more than that. Uh, flame organs. Okay, at least I've got more arrows now. They're making arrows. I've got some food. Not a lot. Ok, 
Okay, so they're all flopping around right now. What am I actually doing here? Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, fire dude, you need to find a house pretty soon. Yep, there you go. So now, pretty soon, I'm gonna build a... That's a grinder. I need wooden stone. Have you, have any of you guys played this game? Okay, so he's making seeds, he's cheering him on, and I've got beds for everybody, so everyone's happy. But I do need to think about making something that's going to de-stress everybody. Uh, what was I doing? Oh yeah, putting shit away. Uh, wasn't there a, uh, some kind of band that I could make? Yeah, leather. How do I get leather? Uh, kill things. Uh, buddy, come here. Do you give leather? Don't actually know. Let's find out. No, you gave something and eggs. Those are more chickens. Because I don't need a smelter at some point to be able to smelt on iron. Grab this. Don't you give leather. Nope, you give pal fluid and ice organs. Picked up a journey note. Ah, that's as good as a journey note. Oh god, what happened there? Uh, go for some. And then let's go back across the water and go kill some things because I know we're gonna have to get some leather so that I can make that band for that one pal so that he can fight with me in tandem. Why does my character feel so slow? It was wool, I think. I don't think that was leather. Oh my gosh. If one of you die, do I get leather? No, I get berries. The bucks can give me leather. You give me another. Berry seeds, nope. Uh, let's go with more stamina. Technology. Do I have access to the smelter yet? Uh, nope. There's a hot spring. That's for them to relax. Sandbergs is. Like it's like a watch point, basically. And then Tundra outfit, this is for hot and cold. There's the furnace. That's what I need. Okay, so next level. I'm going to level up one more time, and then I should be good on that. I forgot which creatures gave leather. I do want that big purple boy. That's a nice mount to have. I think that was just more wool. The game feels, the game feels very stuttery. Okay, so they're all busy fighting this big thing. 
So the more they fight it, hopefully they fuck up itself. Oh no, wrong one. Where'd the big guy go? Oh no, he's running away. Oh god damn. No pulse spheres. Do I seriously not have any pulse spheres? So I've got to run all the way home to go make some. those. Cancel the rest of the job. Uh, let's make 21. I'm only going to make 10. And I'm going to take 10 and I'm going to leave that job for somebody else. To finish. I'll take that. Those 11 can be built by someone else. I have to run back up this fucking hill. Got 43 arrows. I'm definitely not fucking with that big guy. So who left? The JJ leave or did Maestro leave? Come on, be nice, be nice, be nice, 69, 86, and 100. Nice, you belong to me now. Thank you. And that's going to be my first mount to be able to run around on. If I have even got the technology to be able to, be able to make the saddle. I don't. Oh my god, that's still like three levels away. Okay, well I've got him. And he's a phenomenal farmer. So I'm going to go build the... The... What's it called? The wood plantation? And then he'll be able to fuck up that shit. So, wood plantation. Where is it? Wood plantation, there we go, insufficient materials, I need wood and paradigm fragments. Wood is easy, it's right here. That should be enough wood, and then the fragments are right here as well. Okay, I've got enough. Uh, logging site. Let's find a nice little flat surface for this. Yeah, we'll put it right there. Nope, that shit's skew as fuck. Okay, let's at least get it straight with this. It's kind of straighter. Oh, come on, you fucking bird, move. Is that straight? Yeah, it's straight. Thank you for helping me.
Oh, did you just decide halfway through, fuck it, you're not gonna help anymore? Well, I appreciate that. Dick. Oh, you've decided to- Oh, no, no, you just- you stopped helping. Oh, you're all going to sleep. Well, thank you very much for the help, I appreciate it. I'll set you for the next 49 seconds and do it myself while you all sleep. That makes no sense. Your paws and your tail is fire. And that's a straw bed. seconds. Hey, you're nice, you're done. And all you fuckers are sleeping. Okay, uh, I need to build a statue of power. I need a whole bunch of palladium. Palladium's right here. I can do that. Well, I could do that now. I need to go find a new one. I'm just gonna farm it until it breaks. See how much I get from a, from a vein. 15 from that vein, that's not bad. And I only needed 10, so that's cool. This little statue of mine, you know what? We're gonna put it right here. Right here where everybody sleeps. Don't want you clipping through the wall though, so right there. He's still got one little helper, because he's nocturnal. Thank you. That's done. Now we can enhance by using capture power, enhance. Yes, we need four for the next one. I've only got one. We can, however, upgrade. Build a crush and build a stone pit, build a logging site. We've already got the logging site. The stone pit comes next. But first thing, I'm going to need another bed for these little creatures. There. And then one more. Right. There. Try and future proof it a bit. I still need wool. And there's a fuck ton of stone here. You're sleeping. You're sleeping. I know where to get another one of those statues. It's up that way somewhere. And then that'll be the entirety of my knowledge. Of where to find those little jade creatures. Next thing is this a hot spring. So I need more pal fluids. I need to kill one of those chickens and then more wood. Thank you. You're all busy for once. Inside, yeah, I can also go and put this guy now. Here we go. Because big boy can now mine like a motherfucker. How? Why? Why? You've got, you've got a plantation right here. Mm, you absolute freaking. Come here. Yes, I'm carrying a big ass deer. You have got one right there. Oh. What did I do? Oh, you're up. Cool. Wait, 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 wait. Why? 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 Why do you go for that tree when there's perfectly fine trees? Okay. That's okay, you're weird. Ooh, 
but I'm slow. Perfectly fine plantation right there for you to get as much wood out as you want to. But no, you've got to go and attack the only fucking tree in sight. I suppose I should also start giving you guys food. And then also, have I leveled up yet? Not yet. To the last ones. Nice. Don't know what the fuck you're doing, but keep doing it. Flareon, dude, I know you've got, like, no job at the moment. Once I've got the smelter, you'll be busy enough. Okay, I need to go kill one or two more pals, so I can get the pal fluid. But I don't know which ones to kill that actually give me pal fluid. I know the little blue ducks did, but I don't see any more of them. Uh, do you give me pal fluid? That's my guy. Never mind. Let's run down the beach and see if there's one down here for me. It's a fox box. I don't think... He's going to give me anything decent or interesting. No, I'm going to kill another one just to get one for my... Never mind. I do not want to kill you. What's this? A rocky egg. Oh, it gave me leather. I needed leather. Are you coming towards land to actually fight me, or are you just going to die in the water? Oh, wait, that's a... That's one that I don't have. But how do I not have spears of... That's the power fluid that I needed. I honestly thought I had fluids available. I had fluid available. I had spheres available. There's a sphere there, so... That's a megasphere. Increase your player level by capturing 30... Pals. What do I want to do with 30 fucking pals? Capture 5 land balls and earn EXP bonus. Why? Once again, what do I need for 5 land balls? I've got all the creatures I need right here. I guess, like, seriously, why the fuck did I even bother? Oh, shit, I'm slow. Uh, let's drop some wood. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's, let's drop here. Oh, uh, wait, can I build a um, thingy now? Yes, I can. A hot spring. A hot spring is for them to chill and relax. And not worry about the day's troubles. There we go, right behind the house. Nice and chilled. Right there.
Here we go. There's a hot spring. Now you motherfuckers can chill. You guys can relax and de-stress and you know, have a ball of a time. Okay, I'm not carrying any more. No, come on. There has to be a reason. I can definitely carry more stone than that. Yeah, I was about to say, there's no fucking ways that that's filled up. Uh, okay, I need my arrows back, thank you. I was about to say, you should definitely be stacking a lot higher than that. Uh, let's have a look. Palladium, okay, I need more palladium, like always. I'll take the spheres. How many spheres do I have? I've got 11. Palladium fragments. Okay, weapon is damaged. Nice. There's always something. Always fucking something going wrong. At least everyone's busy. That motherfucker is going apeshit on that tree. Repair. 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 Can't repair you because I need cloth for that. Okay, that shit's all repaired. Now I cannot go get what I need. Uh, it's not that. What did I want to build? I wanted to build something. Nope, I wanted to do this. And for that, yes, I've got enough. Ooh, that's going to take a while. Yeah, coming to make your own necklace. Nice. Daydream's necklace. Daydream? I'll have to look out a bit more for you. In the original Pokemon, I was always, always, always a fan of Psychic and Ghost. Uh, Pokemon. Thank you. Just abandoning me. Just, just fuck you. And just buy. I feel like that was completely unnecessary, but it's okay. My dreams necklace. Yeah. Okay. So you apparently. Now, how do I? Figure out if my dream chaser is close by. Oh, he stays literally right by. That's nice. I like that. Now, does that mean I can have another? Oh, okay. So if I call him out, her, him, I don't actually know. It is a... It's a her. If I call her out, she will then go and do whatever she wants to. However, the rest of the time, she's just on my shoulder. She's a Pikachu. So I've got Dark Ball, Poison Ball, and then an empty skill slot. And no passive skills yet. Level Sync. You won't be able to effectively use spells at a high level than you. Their stats will be lower to match those of your character's level. Okay, so she's actually level 10, but uh, she's being down level to level 9. I can respect that. There we go. You finally figured out that there's a whole fucking tree that you're supposed to be attacking. Yeah, plantation. Not all the fucking trees in the area. I'll pick up everything else.
Put this shit away. Oh my god, I've got like 12 balls inside ya. Yeah? What the hell is wrong with me? I've got 23 spheres now because I keep putting them away. Magic fucked out of stones. Okay, I think we've got enough resources for a bit. The wood shouldn't be there. That shouldn't be there, that shouldn't be there. I think I'm gonna try and switch these around. We'll take this out, we'll take- no, we'll keep that in there. Got a whole bunch of arrows that were in there as well for some stupid reason. So now all my general crafting goods are in one location. I'll take that out. Yeah, I'm gonna try and keep it this way. Try and keep my general crafting goods in one box. Uh, I'm gonna take all of those because all of those can go inside there. So the the creatures have got food. Nothing inside here. Nothing inside here that I want. Cloth. I'm gonna make five. No, I'm just gonna create two. I don't know if I'm gonna need cloth or where exactly I need cloth, but. We'll pick it up. And the cloth can go inside here as well. That's my general general resources. Don't know what that is. It's gonna be a while before I can get that. High quality workbench, metal pickaxe. I just want this, the primitive for furnace. Then at least I can put the other one to work. Okay. What happens now? So we've got a couple of things working. Oh, I need to for the rest of my XP. I'll pick up that. I need to get rid of this rock. And that might be easier said than done. Okay, it's smaller. Because the thing that I want to build here is the stone pit. I can't because it intersects with that. So, destroy this. I'm gonna get a decent amount of stone from it as well as palladium fragment because I'm always low on for some reason. And that's general resources, so there you go there. Okay, that thing's going a while I've got the space. Let's quickly put this guy down. Right there. Okay, and whoever wants to build that can build that. And then open up the options menu with escape and check the survival guide. Okay, that's done. Build your base until it reaches level 7. Do I seriously have to go and capture five Lambles? What the fuck am I gonna do with five Lambles? Let's go catch these five fanballs. Actually, I want to see what it's like if I fight this guy now. How quickly we kill it. Your shit's getting fucked up, son. Yep, all kinds of fucked up. Leather horns and venison. Nice. Capture five lambles to earn an ex EXP bonus. So five of them. 
I do like the fact that this little chick now chills on my shoulder. Come on, little Pikachu. Those are chickens. Okay, chicken. Lambo. Fifty-one percent. Sixty-six, seventy-six on my car. I can't speak. Okay, that's one. That's technically the level that I needed for the furnace. Three arrows simultaneously only consumes one arrow per shot. I want that. That's gonna be OP. Feather hairband. Beautiful feathered hairband. Somehow protects its wearer from lethal head injuries. I want that. And then nails. And I am hungry. Just eat some raw meat. Why not? That seems safe. Oh. Don't kill it. I'm trying to capture it. Fuck sex. You received the bonus XP for capturing the same type of Pokemon up to 10 times. I haven't caught these things 10 times. Oh, I will. Never mind. I'm with you. Okay, so I need to capture two more of those, and I'm literally just going to release them. I've got no need for those little sheep. Are you dead? Yeah. Now you're not dead. Forty-five. Seventy-three. Yeah, you're good. You can take up to five powers with you at any time. Capturing them more that you will automatically be sent to your power box. That's good. So they've all leveled up. I would like you. What are the chances of catching you? None. Okay, so we're not going to fuck with you right now. Because you're a dragon... Dragon grass type, by the looks of it. There's another one of those little statue things, so I want that for sure. Oh, did I not capture you? Well, fuck me then. captured now thank you okay there's the five that i needed sorry senior badass crossing the bridge see i don't want any of these motherfuckers challenge the boss at ryan syndicate's tower make sure your piles and equipment are in top condition i'm guessing that's a bit of wishful thinking like goddamn uh, party. Can I release these? Sadist. Okay. Uh, oh, I can. You can. Yes. 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 And I'll keep one just because I've got one of every type then. Still got 13 of those left. Got some wood. I'll keep one. Because why not? I need to capture a chicken as well. Eh, let's just capture a chicken, why not? I'm trying to at least get one of every type. I'll try and focus more on like... The more badass Pokemon... Uh, Pokemon. The more badass... Um, pals. But the base little bitches would not be fucked. What up? Ooh, there's a chest. Can I open that chest? Gold coins, pal sphere, and small pal souls. Don't know what coins do. Got an egg. Okay, so I've already got one fire type. Are we, uh, now this is the question, are we going to try and like, get one of every type to fight with? 
or do I just have one of every type? So regardless of whether it's in my house or... Hmm. Dilemma. Inventory enhanced that. Just increase my weight a bit. Because that seems to be the one thing I'm constantly running low on. I think I've got one of those ducks. Definitely not fucking with you. It'd be nice to have you, but... No, I'm at a point to want to fuck with you yet. You guys? Yeah. Let's put this shit away. Uh, you go there, you go there, you go there, you go there. Horns I'm not worried about right now. And you go there, everything else has got a separate place. Actually, I should keep the food in one place as well. So, food, 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 food. I'm guessing, because technically it's an ingredient. Okay, that's a material. That's a venom gland. That's another egg. Make clothing. Okay, so this, the rest of them are all materials. Okay, so you can go into the last one. Let me just grab everything else out of here. That, 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 I'll keep that with me. That, 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 and that. You guys can all stay there. Food, go stay. You, go there. Ooh, those could be nice. Make some lamb or kebabs. Oh yeah, I forgot, I leveled up, so... Go with the smelter. You, I definitely want. But you, I'm gonna put over here by the front door. Because with you over there... If this fat ass moves it... There we go. We build this, we can then start smelting down... The iron. And we can say iron, as many as we can possibly make, start production, and my little fire dude will deal with that the moment he can. Okay, so I've already got one of them in there. There's the chicken. You can fuck off. You are keep. Oh. So you can be released. I'm just going to leave you inside that little prison for the rest of your life on the ground. Is there a way that I can hide that? Options. Uh, game settings. And mouse. Hide checked on. Mouse sensitivity is fine. Graphics. Yeah, that's all fine. Okay. There's no way for me to hide that base info. Oh god, okay, um... Yeah, we're gonna take a nice little slow walk back to our chest. I did not think there was so much wood there. Oh yeah, one more thing to do is build the crusher. The crusher I'm gonna have to play somewhere else. You know what, uh, let's... Split this in half. And you can for right now. Stack all this shit away. Pick up all of that. Pick up 
like that. All the berries don't need to be in there because I'm not going to be using berries of any kind. All the berries can go inside. This bitch. Food for the kids. Okay, I think right now... Yep, I've only got two. I need four for the capture power. That's good, that's good, that's good. Everything's good. Let's get some sleep. Okay, next thing. Crusher, you I'm going to build around the back of you because you're an ugly piece of equipment. So I'm just going to put you right there. Crusher. Alright, fuck it. Let's put you right. Okay, I need you to kind of move. You're in my way. Thank you. Hey. Nope. Cancel. You go there. Chill there for a bit. Because all you were doing was getting in my way. That's on a bit of a slope. Yeah, you're fine there. Now you can come back to me. Thank you. Let me help him with this. Okay, crush is built, that means all of the missions are now done, so I can effectively upgrade this again. Yes, I can. And I can upgrade it again. Yes. High quality workbench, medieval medicine workbench, and deploy a pile work. Work pile to the base. Oh, I need two more. Uh, I'm not going to deploy any of those. She's my fighter for now. It's a level on her. She's level one. Partner skill. They're all level one. Oh, dream catcher. Dream chaser. She's level nine. Attack is 188. 160. Oh, so this one's attack is actually better. 188, 163. Hmm, okay. This one's still busy making my ingots. Very nice. Ingots go inside there. As a base material again. You get put inside there. Okay, now I need to figure out. Challenge the boss of Ryan's. Okay, so that's the tutorial. I think we've done everything we need to for the base. Because there are a couple of things that we need to build though. High quality workbench, yes, I need to get. Medieval workbench, I need to get, yes. The saddle will crush. I think at this point it's just a case of leveling up and fighting a whole bunch of shit, so. Let's go get into some trouble. What are my arrows looking like? I've got 41 arrows left. How do I make that three shot bow? Thank you. I want the three shot bow. I know it's going to take a little bit to craft, but if it's only consuming one arrow. But I fire three shots. Seems like a upgrade to me. Working a little slow, probably a slacker. Eh, it's okay. You're watering plants. That's all you're doing. I don't mind if you're a slacker. God damn, this thing's taking long to build. Oh, 
require. Okay, so now let's have a look. So, how do I switch this out? Okay, so now I've got a new one over there. Three, and it still only consumes one shot. Nice. Okay, that's going to be very, very awesome. Uh, let's build some more. Uh, let's build this. Just one. Feathered hairband to help my head from those critical blows. Okay, so you can build that. I will in the meantime. Okay, that. And nope, we're not going to waste on that. And then I can make some more arrows potentially. Okay, so that literally just adds 15 defense. Fair enough. Uh, let's grab some arrows. We're getting there, slowly but surely. Okay, so I think whoever wants to build that can build that. I'm just going to grab the six that I did. Nothing I can do inside there. Nothing I can do inside there because I don't have... I can pick up Fox Park as a flamethrower, but I don't want to do that. I think that's kind of stupid. Two more levels, then I can get the saddle for that bitch and I can move around. I've got the belt armor. High quality workbench, so that will be the next thing that I've got to build. So ingot and nails. So I need to think about... Picking up more iron, as and when I can. Because I technically... Technically got the ingots full, but I'm going to be down to three. So I want to try and stay ahead of that as much as I can. So I think I'm going to go to one of the metal nodes. And along the way, I'm just going to keep fighting shit. The more I fight, the more I level. I want to see if I can fuck with that big guy, but I know it's going to be a bad idea. Another one dead. No, two dead. Got some leather. I'm hungry. Yes, I am. I'm just eating raw steak. Why not? It's the worst that's going to happen. Yeah, at this point, it probably seems pretty fucked up because what I'm doing is just running around to everything, killing it. I want you. I want you. You. Come down Yeah, I'm gonna fuck with you. Yeah, that's not gonna be nice. No chance of that happening. What are the chances? 46%. None. No, don't kill it. I love you, but fuck you. You're not supposed to kill it, you dummy. Uh, let's go with some more. Okay, capacity. I can love you, but that was kind of stupid. Metal, metal. Having metal of that's going to be nice. Bear trap, don't need it. One more level and then I can get the... The fuck? Why did I go blank? What is it? I'm the saddle.
Berry seeds. I'm picking up a whole bunch of shit. But I'm already down to like... What? How did I burn through so many arrows? So it's kind of scary that you're not giving me a health bar. Because I know your shit will fuck me up badly. Okay, let's grab a whole bunch of ore. And it's basically why we are trying to fill up my inventory with as much ore as I can. I'm going to need metal ore for the metal pickaxe, for the metal hatchet. I'm going to need it for the uh, workbench. I need it for a whole bunch of things, so... It's going to be relatively important that I make sure I get a lot of this. But I also don't know when my pickaxe is about to break, but I'm sitting on 30 already, so it's already an improvement. But I don't know how many ore is required to make an ingot, so... Still got to figure out that as well. I've got the one um, now at the base, the big deer. I've got that one doing all the farming and stuff, so I'm probably going to have to catch another one. That's going to be my main transporter. Don't need that. Oh, come on. What can I drop? That's going to be minimal. I'll drop you. Yeah, that's enough. I need another elk. Getting down yeah, relatively quick. Getting back up is the shit pot. Uh, let's grab this. Let's make as many as we can. 28. Start production. Okay, so I'm going to have 28 ingots from that. And that little flareon is going to do... Oh, he's igniting the light for me. Well, that's nice. Uh, let's put that away. Let's... What goes there? That's wood normally, right? I'm confused now. Oh, well. uh, let's put the food away. The seeds away. We'll put some berries inside here. Why not? And then everything else that's left goes inside there. Still can't believe I burned through so many arrows so quickly. And I'm going to need. So let's have a look. I can build the workstation. I need 10 nails. Oh no. Okay, that's going to give me 20. So let's cancel this. All I need is 5. take a while to get these nails that's for fucking sure actually buddy can you come out and potentially help me yes you can thank you you're a star but 
honestly don't feel like you're doing much. Oh, for some reason it was registering the work that I was doing. That's a lot faster. But I'm guessing this is one of the shit things about this this game. Is all the, yeah, like any survival game. The only resource things are easy to gather, easy to get, and easy to build. The moment you start taking your steps into the mid game and the late game, shit takes forever to build. It's one of the reasons why I got bored of Satisfactory. Because in the beginning it was nice, eventually everything, your production lines are so fucking convoluted. You don't know what the hell's happening. And this should be the last two. There we go, got everything. Now from that, we can build... What? How do I have... Okay. Oh, ingots. I'm short on ingots. Okay, uh, let's grab you. Okay, just come into my house by all means. Uh, what can I buy from you? The fuck is all this electric skill food? Use on pal to teach lock on laser. Acid rain. Okay. Well, that's pretty cool. Uh, let's put this away. Let's put that away. I wanted to build the high quality bench. There's no space for the bench here, so I'm gonna put this bench by this door. I don't want it sticking out the window, so yeah, that works. How straight is that? Yeah, that's fine. Okay, inside here, I can now make the metal pickaxe. And the metal axe. And that should mean my production should be, f my gathering should be faster. Little man is hungry. Okay, you're back to my side. A little bit of teamwork makes it go a little bit faster. Okay, let's select the next recipe. We want the metal axe. Okay, you carry on building that. I'm gonna replace this with this quickly. You are going to be discarded. You and you can replace the stone axe. So that means you can get discarded as well. And you can get discarded as well. Metal pickaxe, metal axe, stone spear. What else can I make in here? Nails. It looks like this is the same thing as this. So why would I need you? Well, I've got both just in case. Let me grab those. For me, one for you. Inventory is full of those things. That's food, so food goes inside there. It's probably gonna spoil before I can even get to it again, but who cares? So let's have a look. How quickly do I gather this now? Yeah, it seems to be a fair bit faster. And I'm guessing this will be the same. Oh yeah, it's a lot faster on the gathering of things. That is awesome. Upgraded everything. We're looking good. Grab my ingots. Put 
that away. I've got 12 ingots. Uh, what else do I have to build? There aren't at some point if I do want to start mating certain things together. Got all of that, got all of that, got a mount of torch, everything we could on over there. Got some decoration shit, which I don't need right now. Decorations will add later. Okay. In the technology section, how am I looking? That's a wooden gate. A knife for butcher butchering summoned pals. The big command become becomes butcher. Butchered pals will not return. What the fuck? Like, does that mean that I like literally cut up? Okay. That's a little fucked. Like, that's really a little fucked, but okay. Like that's like, like that's really fucked up, but okay. Um, I don't have one of you, so I'm gonna get one of you. Yeah. If before that happens. Okay, so that's leather and wool. Yeah. So that's you out. Very nice. And I think that might be a mount. Yeah, I can build a saddle for it if I want to. But I'm so close to this one saddle, I might just as well stick with that. My next level up is basically going to be that in any case, so. Let's put away that, let's put away that. And then we can release you into the rest of the family. What exactly it is that you do, fuck knows. You just god. Uh, pal deck. I have not seen one of those. I don't know why it's lying to me. I have not seen a dire hull. If I had seen one of those, I would have caught it. Oh, so it farms. Okay. What does a dire hull do? No daughter. No daughter. You're gathering handiwork transporting. You just plant. And you do kindling. thing is lying to me. I have not seen a dire hull. That was two in one shot. Nice. Uh, I'm going to need to catch one of the big boys. So let's go to sleep. And then once we've slept, we can... Let me see if I can't catch another one of the elks. And then compare which alk is better. And then that'll be the... Because it has left the base. Bye, Felicia. Oh, I actually don't have one of you. Instead of killing you, I should maybe try and catch one of you. Okay, there's another alk. So let's go fuck with that. Oh my god, please don't tell me that you decided to fuck with it. No, no, no. Oh, no, no. I'm not fighting you. Oh, hell no, that's not happening. Okay, run. Run, run. Run, run, run. What? 
You're coming with me. We're not fucking fighting that thing. That's not happening. You can calm your tits. Okay, now that we're not gonna die the next time we run past there. The fuck is wrong with you? You stupid. Ooh, these metal pickaxes, this metal equipment is a lot better than the shit that I had. That's very nice. Yeah, but I think it's time we have to start exploring. But you see, I can't explore yet until I've got the saddle creature. I'm not going to fucking run all around this place. Killing the fucking shit. What is wrong with you? Catch you, catch you, catch you. Thank you, that's another one of those that I wanted. Uh, let's put my health up a little bit. Technology, I can now finally get this motherfucker saddle. And the medieval workbench, and the pelt armor. And the house plant set. Nice. Okay, so now that you've basically been responsible for me getting my ass handed to me, dick. Let's go compare the stats of the two. So this one has got 183135. Okay, so you go there, you come to me. 183135, 158, yep. Definitely going to want to use that one instead. Let's see what I can put away. Put away, put away, put away, put away, put away. The rest of you is food. So you go there, there, and there, and you go on to the last one. Nice. How much do I need for this bitch? Start production. It's going to take a while. I need your help with this, thank you. Once I've got this motherfucker with a saddle, it's gonna be my primary pal. I'll keep wanting to say Pokemon, my primary pal. It's gonna make it take a while to build this fucking saddle, but yeah, fair enough. This is taking so goddamn long. It better be worth it. 
Well, I know it's worth it because I have ridden an elk before. Oh, God. Okay, cool. Now that that's done. I am going to come over here. You can go inside there. You, my dear friend. I can now ride you. Oh, my God. There is so much more better. And I can cover quite a bit of ground like that. This made life a billion times better. Okay, so now we can actually start exploring in directions that we haven't gone yet. Ooh, okay. Oh, well, I just want to get off you. You can come back in. I've got enough arrows for you. Come here. Yeah. Come on, be nice. Be nice. Be nice. Be nice. I said be nice. It's 55. Come on. All over. Nope. I, you're gonna keep you're gonna keep going to this fucking ball until you stay. I only got three left though, so potentially gonna have to kill you. 78, come on, please stay, please stay. Fucking gorgeous. Because I think. Would I have the saddle for you already? No, you only come at 15. Okay, you know what? That's fine. I've at least got you. Okay, so I've got the flying type now. Hillside Cavern. This has got challenge the boss and rides in a good time. What the fuck is in this? In, in the dungeon. Yeah. Um. Okay, so one of two things is going to happen. I'm probably going to get fucked up. Yeah, that's just a whole bunch of you. You I can fight. You I'm not worried about. Are you going to automatically start fighting me? No, you're not. See? You're fine. I don't know what you are, though. It's a... It's a mole? A mole? What is a mouth? The fuck wants to fight me now? Well, fuck you then. What did you give me? Gold coins. Gold coins. Fuck me. Okay. Uh, Paldic. What is a mouth? 40. 118, 109, 91. This is good for farming. So it's dark and sand. Okay. It's a new creature I never had, so fuck it. Okay, so this is where we come for the big veins. Very nice. So we can come inside here for quite a bit of the palladium as well as iron. Yeah, what's further down the cage? Cave. Cage. Okay, there's a big ass boss. Oh, there's syndicate members in there. So, what were they? Who were they? 
Learned air cannon. Okay, cool. You learned something new. GG for you, bro. Yeah, you're gonna get fucked up if you fuck with my elk. Defeated Syndicate Thug. Nice, GG. So, I've got no idea why I'm in here. If I should be in here. If this is a good idea for me or not. Probably isn't. I don't know how I'm gonna find my way out of here. That's another mole. That's a mole. I don't see more a mole. Because it's a cat, I'm probably guessing it's going to be closer to mole than anything else. Okay, so that just goes further. I think let's not fuck around in here too long. I think let's actually head out. If I can remember how the fuck to get out. I know that's down that water path, but I just want to see what's down this passage. Let's see if this goes anywhere. Ooh, chest. This looks like trouble. Coins, bread, and megasphere. Okay. Got 999 coins. Okay, so dungeon seems like something that I'd like to explore more. I got a new pal in here, and I de defeated my first syndicate members. Another syndicate thug. Most Syndicate Thugs defeated. I literally just came from this room, so I'm surprised that there were so many. Why? Why? What? What did this thing do to you? It did nothing to you. You're just being a fucking bully. Like, goddamn. I think this is where I came from. Yes, it was. Now, which one was the exit? I'm almost convinced that was the exit because I think I looped around once. Oh, god damn, I can't remember. Yes, I think that's the entrance to the cave over there. What the fuck are you? You're a fuddler. What is a fuddler? I don't know what a fuddler is, but it looks kind of cool. A fuddler. It's large claws boast of diamond-like hardness. However, the sharpening of these claws consumes most of its energy. It spends some days doing nothing. Well, that's fine. It's another pal I did not have. This seems like a very big room. Why do I really want to fuck with that and see if I can catch it? Do I have any spheres on me? Yes, I do. I've got two mega spheres. I have got two shots. I want to yeah. catch you. I highly doubt I'm going to be able to catch you, but... No, I must. Come on, be nice. 100% capture it. Did I... Did I catch a boss? Hmm. 
Akku du Boss. Wow. That's fucking awesome. Ooh, where does that teleport me? Open. Open. Leave dungeon. Yes. Okay, that was kind of cool. Yeah. Okay, that was really fucking cool. Oh, nice. Okay, so you go inside there. You go inside there. 199. So you're 198 with 151. You're 199. Your defense ain't that great, but you're like two levels lower. I'm keeping you. You're going to be my transport. You're going to be my fighter. That's kind of cool. I did not expect that we're going to be walking out of here with a boss today. Let's put some shit down. Uh, put that away. Put that away. Put that away. Put that away. Ancient civilization. That's a spark plug. So does this take part? Take place way in the fucking future. Well, okay then. Uh, let's see. Uh, can I put any of this stuff anyway? Okay then. You guys just need to go, I guess. There, 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 and then I can take that off my hands. And put you away. Sold to a merchant. Okay, so these things are high prices, high value items. So they might sell. Sounds good. And I need more spheres. I can't make spheres here. Spheres get made. Here. Yes, we're gonna make a fuck ton of spheres. Do I have the. I have the blueprint for. Oh no, next one. Megaspheres is the next one. Okay, so for now, I'm just gonna make a whole bunch of these. That's a good question. How many of these can I make? Yep, just make me all the fucking arrows. Whatever arrows you can make, just make them. I think while they were busy getting themselves sorted out, I can take you. Let's make as many of you as what I can. All my pals are about run about doing something. Oh my god, I'm heavy. I did not mean to take so much. Uh, you can split in two, and you I'm going to drop quickly. Nope, I'm still too heavy. Split that again. Drop that. Just gonna drop off what I do have. Oh my god. How heavy was the shit? How heavy is wood? You're doing that. That's good. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. Oh god damn it. Anybody started making any of the stuff that I asked them to make? Nope. They're still just flopping around doing their own shit. Okay, so I've got like zero stone in there. 
I bet you over here. Oh, we've got a nice line over here either. You're doing your thing, you're doing your thing. Okay, I'm gonna grab the pickaxe. What I do with the pickaxe is still good. Oh no, hell no, that's not gonna be worth it. It's gonna be fast if I just do this. It's a lot fucking faster. Hey, welcome back, brother. Uh, you went through the patch notes for next league. They are gutting tornado shot. No. Why? Why every single time we get a nice build does it get fucking nerfed to shit? It's fucking annoying. I don't fucking understand why they keep doing that. Like, I remember when Cyclone was a nice thing. Everybody loved playing Cyclone. And they gutted the fuck out of Cyclone. Okay, so how many of these things do I have now? So I have got 25 spheres. I need arrows now more than anything else. Uh, where are some of these small little shits? There's one farming. One's there. One's fucking around doing nothing. The other one's fucking around doing nothing. The other one's... Chilling inside. A bubble bath. That requires watering. You're working at least. Actually, let's do this. Um, I know one of these. One of these little shits I can actually grab. I can grab you. Do that. You should then technically pop out. Yep, you're going to be with me. Which is nice. You I'm going to throw at that. Yeah. And you can work there while I work here. Yeah, that works. Okay, I've got 32 balls. I don't think I need many more than that right now. The Arctic armor, I don't think I can make there. No. But I also need to make... Uh, infrastructures. This one. I need five nails for that. It takes forever, I forgot. That's making that. I'll just continue doing this. It sucks balls, but yeah. Okay, you're still going strong, busy making those arrows. That's nice. Like, I don't know how much you've seen Maestro. Okay, never mind. Maestro's gone. Oh, I'm hungry. Ah. 
How many nails do I have? I've got so I technically only need to make two more. Actually, I need to make three more, but you can't make just three, so I'm gonna have to make four, so. Okay, hopefully. And then that is done, then I can build the medicinal workbench, and I think then it's going to be us for the evening. Collect those, we'll cancel the rest of the job. You're still making arrows like a boss, thank you very much. I want to create the medicine workbench. The medicine workbench can't go there, can't go there, so it's gonna have to go right. Oh god, uh, where can you go? Oh, you can go in there, nice. It's a little bit further back, a little bit scoochy over to the side, and done. And I leveled up, which is nice. I think that was the last thing I have to do. Oh no, I need to deploy one more pal at the base and then the thing can be upgraded again. Nice. Now what does this do? Okay, this makes my potions. Okay, don't know what that is all about just yet. Got 74 arrows. Uh, let's enhance my shit a bit more. Let's increase my work speed. Because I think that's something that's currently slowing me down quite a bit. Technology. Okay, so metal spear, 100%. Mega spheres, 100%. Sphere workbench, yes. Wall torches, yes. Storage, yes. Cooler box, yes. Crossbow, yes. I still got two technology points left. I think that's it for now. It does, however, mean that I just. I've got another thing to make. I need one. I need ten nails. That's gonna fucking wait. I need nails for all this shit. Uh, antique wardrobe for storing items. Bookshelf for storing items. Okay, so it's decorational as well as... Adorned with a photo of a pal. Oh yeah, nice. So these are all storing items, but just makes it look nicer. Ah, that's really fucking cool. Wall torch, that's nice. House plants. Very nice. I can put myself a house plant down just to add some life to it. <laughs> Not gonna do that now. Next level, I get the saddle for Nightwing. I can call you back. Actually, you can go over there. You can continue making arrows. Got 104 at the moment. What can I put away here? Wrong button, but fair enough. Okay, that's what I've got. Iron, I've got quite a bit of wood, quite a bit of stone, quite a bit of fiber, quite a bit of leather, and quite a bit of wool. So we are looking better in general. Got 32 of those. I need to see what it's going to cost to make. Okay, I don't think I can make it. Yeah, I think I need to make it at the specific workbench. I think there's a sphere workbench that's going to cover that kind of shit. So, that's something we do later on. For right now, I'm going to keep those jobs there. I'm going to keep this Pokemon, oh, this Pokemon, this pal with me. I am really, really happy that we were able to uh, get ourselves one of the bosses. I think he's going to come in handy in a fight. He looks pretty badass. We've actually made quite a bit of progress this evening. We built our little block house. We've got down some beds. We've got two farming stations. We've got the power box. We've got two um, farming plots. We've got the spring for them to relax. We've got the crusher if we want to get rid of some items. Oh, 
I don't know what that's gonna do. Cause wood. We can produce this? Oh, okay, well that's interesting. We've got actually quite a lot of things that we got done. Our pal situation has also increased. Which I'm really happy about. And the fact that we've actually got a boss. Yeah. It's not bad. Good at gathering, good at mining, and good at transporting. Might be somebody we need to put to work. But yeah, everything is looking good. Thank you very much to everybody who joined the live stream. I really do appreciate it. I know there's not a lot of interaction at the moment, but as we grow, that will obviously grow as well. Now, while we're speaking about growth, I am going to reach out to everybody that watches to help in that regard. Reach out to friends, reach out to family, reach out on social network, however and wherever you can. Spreading the word would be massively appreciated. We're trying to get to that 50 follower goal. We've got 15 at the moment, so we're getting there. Slower than I thought, but progress is still progress. So thank you very much and much love to everybody that has shown that love and support. It really does mean a lot. For those of you that are also curious, all of my past live streams do get posted onto a YouTube channel that you can go and subscribe to and turn on those notifications so that if you did miss a live stream, you've got a general place to catch up. And don't forget, we do have a Discord, a place where outside of the streams you can chill, chat, relax, and a place where you can basically grow as a community. But I hope you all have a lovely day and or night, depending on where you are from. Look after yourselves. Much love and see you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.